All right, people, welcome back. More Daily Duel. So we are once again joined by Alexis. Meow. <laughs> okay. Uh, this hand, it would be so much better if I had circle. Uh, More darkness. Powerful. Anyway, well, it looks like you like it looks like in order to do this video, you must first destroy yourself. Nope, dark you bow. <laughs> okay. Then say like, oh yeah, you're playing black wings. Up, you're definitely dark you bow because I don't like black wings. <laughs> <laughs> so he's the so he's the reverse of you in every way. Yep. <laughs> this will be an interesting battle. Probably not, cause it's freaking black wings. Like, <sighs> jump the shit out of you with black wings. Yep, but mm -hmm. it's a Yubel versus a Yubel. Well, I don't think either of us are actually playing a Yubel deck unless you're playing Yubel black wings, which shouldn't even even know ever know. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. I can picture somebody making that, too. Go into Rekiri, because why the fuck not, I guess? He makes that, I'm going to be very surprised, because it's like it's a good card, but why would you make it turn one? Because it looks like he might actually go for his level 12 Synchro first turn. And I'll run it over first turn. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, wait, that's not the Synchro Tuner, is it? 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Well, I mean, it only requires a syn two synchros to get its full effect, so. Yep, yep, yep. Bam, there it is! Ernie <laughs> Martin! Uh, GG! GG! <laughs> let's see what my hand is. Uh, my hand is not very good, but let's see if I can make it work. Okay. I have to draw into something with my Allure of Darkness. Yeah, hey, everybody play the Allure of Darkness. So there you go, people. Black News on first turn, Oni Martin. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like this hand, but let's see what I can do with it. Shouldn't be too hard to get rid of his monster. I mean, all you have to do is run it over. It only gains the 3,000 when it attacks. Wait, what? Let me let me read that. Yeah, if this card attacks. So, nope. yeah, this, this will be easy. All I gotta do is fusion summon twice. How hard can that be? I don't know. Okay. It depends on your opening hand. You know how I feel about this deck. This deck sometimes it opens up. If you can bust out the the power, then it's great. But sometimes it just kind of runs powders out when it comes to polys. Well, I have a poly play. At the very least, I can make it so he can't hurt me. Okay. Get back the wolf. Hmm. Mm hmm. Is going into Panther Dancer, I mean, what is Panther Dancer going to do? I mean, if you had a uh, um, Fox, then you could have dropped him to zero and attacked over him, but... I don't have Fox. Mm. I think that might have been one of the cards that got deleted. I think that might have been. Oh well, I'm going to set these two and he can't run over my Cat Dancer. And before he has, you know, if he has Twin Twister, what does it matter? He has no cards in his hand. True. I think you maybe had Icarus attack, but why would you want to get rid of your only Maru if Icarus attack? And have absolutely nothing. If he Icarus attacks and get rid of, gets rid of his only card that he's probably going to have this whole game, he's probably not very good. Don't worry about the only Maru. I can handle that. That's nothing. <laughs> I can handle it too. I just didn't have a very good opening hand. And also, why is it still on my turn? Because we're waiting for him to respawn during the end phase with something. Is he honestly thinking about using that Icarus attack? If he wants to. Like, hey, you can have that. I ain't even more mad at it. Like, not even. You're pretty much out of this duel. You went so balls deep with your freaking Blackwing plays, and I don't even like what you did. Are like, you going to go balls deep use your entire hand just for Onimaru? <laughs> oh. Okay, that was, that was actually terrifying. <laughs> I forgot about that. I forgot that they have their own kind of pseudo-heavy stone, because Blackwings have everything. Black Wings get all the love, and yet here I am praying that Ajamas will one day get those two Ajamas on Jama Country. Ew. Also, I think we're about to die. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was going to say, let's have a decent duel, and never mind, it's fucking Draco. It's like, ew. <laughs> also, why is my Moonlight Tiger negated? Uh, Vector. Oh, right, 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 right. <laughs> I'm dumb. I'm dumb. Also, why don't you summon an a Alexandrite Dragon? I don't know. I thought you were playing Dracos for a second. That's what I was thinking too, but obviously it's not. I mean, my anxiety is already setting in, so we can just go ahead and get that out of the way. 
And knowing our luck, that set card's probably face off. Why on earth would you set a face off? Because he could play it during our turn, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> also, why would you bother attacking a monster that can't be destroyed in battle? Because he thought he could destroy it by battle? This is true. We all know that Blackwing players don't read. Hmm. Nah, uh, because even if I do that, there's really no point in me doing that. Why do I feel like that face down might be solemn warning? Because I can go pitch you, summon you, then send you, and XC into you. Like, that doesn't do anything. That doesn't do anything. Knowing our luck, it might be solemn warning, but I guess we'll go ahead and try. So, what are you gonna. What deck are you playing anyway? Uh, Dark Magician. Ah, uh, ooh, Relinquish. It's too bad you can't take. Wait, can you? Oh, right, you can. <laughs> so, the Blackwing player is officially out of this duel. Pretty much, but Thousand Iris Strike, no other monsters can attack, and I can't attack with Thousand Iris Strike because of Instant Fusion. So. Yeah, that's kind of the downside to using Instant Fusion with Thousand Eyes. You can't do anything else for that turn, basically. Pretty much, so. I'm done. Unless you're playing like a rank 1 Chaos deck or something. Okay, I think on my next turn, I'm actually going to summon Panther Dancer now. No, wait, that's probably a bad idea. It's not a terrible idea. Yeah, but I'd have to banish my cat dancer if I did. I'm thinking about activating this and getting a dark magic attack. If I can summon Demok later. Well, I say do it. If my okay. cat dancer dies, I can just use Wolf to get a panther dancer out. True. So, I'm gonna go ahead and grab me a dark magic attack. And then you can start messing up them pendulum plays. Yeah, it's just can we wrap it all the way back around to me? Because I can go ahead and summon Dark Mission and do Dark Magic Attack because if the Eternal Soul survives till then. Also, can you hear me? Because I'm still feeling a little bit sick. I'm not sure how loud I am. You sound fine. Yay, I'm not a mute. And if you don't sound fine, I can always just edit you in Camtasia. Yeah, I finally figured out how to get that. Now I just gotta figure out how to use it. Well, which one? Studio 8? Yeah. Yeah. Well, just to know, uh, just so you know, uh, Contagious piece of shit, and I hate it, and I will never pay for it, ever. <laughs> well, I didn't pay for it. I figured out how to get it. <laughs> You're... Also, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna summon my strongest fusion monster. Yeah, if you can bust her out, but they don't have you to oh, be wait, lightning. That, that's right, I, I can't, because you need my two. tiger is, my tiger is negated. Oh, yeah, that's true. Your tiger is negated. Unless you have some way of getting rid of that vector, which I have current moment, not really. <laughs> I don't. I mean, I can I can solar recharge your thousand after struck back, but why would I? Maybe I should just end my turn with a cat dancer in defense mode. Uh, he might be able to handle it next turn because he'll probably be able to summon another level four and go into like castell or something. I guess you got the bottomless to protect it, so that's up to you. Well, I mean, my hand doesn't have any real plays, that's why. And that's why I can't stand that deck. It takes so much resources to pull off plays. Well, to be honest, I have the resources. I just can't do it because of Vector. Yep, so... What I'm do gonna you end mean? my turn. Send your turn? Alright. I'm assuming he's just gonna go ahead and summon a level 4 and then Castell you. Or attempt to Castell you. I hope. <laughs> the next turn, I will be able to summon a Dark Magician and go Dark Magic Attack, so... One sec, I need to quickly do something. Oh. Sink 6, I'm assuming? What are you gonna sink 6 into? What, what can possibly handle it? You're dark, right? Yeah, you're dark, so you can't even go into... Wait, that's not 6, that's 5. Hello? <laughs> what? Um, Coral. 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 Will work. Coral Dragon, go ahead and pop, I'm assuming. I got, I got one question. Why is there a Galaxy Serpent on the field? Because it looks like he's about to sink 6. I don't know what life is anymore, you bell. Coral Dragon, that was right. Ah, I called it! Oh my god, I'm like fucking psychic, man. So, yeah. uh, he's gonna pop your uh, Moonlight can I'm gonna bottomless that. Think sure. I should? Sure. Now, he already used his normal summon. The only thing I'm worried about is a mass pendulum summon. But I guess that's better than getting your uh, Cat Dancer popped at the current moment. Yeah. But yeah, I think if I ever need someone to predict the future, I'm just gonna come over to you and save myself the 20 bucks that they, uh, what do they call them, fortune readers? Mm-hmm. Because you seem to always know what's gonna happen, how it's gonna happen, and how badly it's gonna happen. Just years and years of playing this fucking game, we call you, yo. <laughs> I've been oh. playing 
Probably as long as you, and I can't do that half the time. Dark magic attack? Get wiped? Because f fuck you! Ah! <laughs> also, wow. you, can my, you can use my cat dancer if you need tribute fodder or something. Uh, I'm okay right now. Just go ahead and tag me. <laughs> All I need to know is why on earth are you running Galaxy Serpent? Uh, because I don't know. he can. Uh, I can do something with Summoner Monk. I'm just not sure if I want to do that. Not like he has anything to stop you. I can Summoner Monk, pitch the Padu Aliyadru, summon XE. Who do I got XE into? Utopia, Utopia, the Lightning, the Dagu Stormer, which I have nothing greater. I cast all does nothing. Uh, Wrath, but the only other trap hole I, or dweller, the only trap hole, other trap hole I have in this deck is space time. So, Black I say Lumi. just go ahead and attack with the two monsters and call it a turn. Then yeah, hold on to my resources for now. Damn, damn that man got his. <laughs> what do you mean? Turn, sorry, there's nothing. On my next, on my next turn, I can summon out the Leo Dancer. Yep, and that's, unless they have Utopia Lightning, that's pretty much GG because he can't be touched, right? She can't be touched by anything, yeah. That's so powerful. Well, I mean, you can Storming Mirror Force it, but I don't think they run that. I thought I could go into a rank 7, but there's really no one I want to go into, so I'm good. Yeah, no reason to use up Cat Dancer yet. Mm -hmm. So you got one card. Do you want to, uh, let me guess, Regeki? You top deck to Regeki? If you top deck to Regeki, I'm blaming you. <laughs> uh, that'd be hilarious if he actually did. <laughs> I mean, well, considering your track record, I wouldn't doubt this. All right, Dark Evil, what you got? <laughs> dark side of me, because there's one. You must be dark side of me, because one, I would never play Black Wings like that, and two, I would never summon fucking Only Army. Sucks. So. <laughs> well, I mean, you, it's not a bad card if you need to run over something for game, but even then, I say it's a one of. You don't, and you definitely don't summon it turn one. It sucks for a level twelve. Well, yeah, but, I mean, not every card is going to be a Quasar, and it's a pod duality. Okay. I'll say pod duality reveal that, Regeki. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> you bell. <laughs> Do me a favor and never do predictions again. <laughs> I'll just stop talking. <laughs> That's fine. Jeez. Oh, uh. <laughs> well, I mean, I'm still gonna make Leo Dancer, but dang it, you bell. <laughs> uh. Why do you do this to me? <laughs> it's too easy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you, you bell, I, I don't know what to do with you anymore. <laughs> Oh wow, just ton of distractions like Icarus? Nah. Mirror Force? Oh well that's close. Nah, I gotta get that Regeki though. <laughs> oh shit. Dark and the sad part is you got you escaped on scratch. I lost my cat dancer. Yep. Nothing that matters. I mean my my tiger can just reborn the cat dancer. Let's go ahead and grab that dark magic attack, just so in case the other guy wants to do anything, we'll just get hit him with it again. <laughs> it's so powerful. Yes. Yeah, so Harpy Feathers Duster is banned, but Dark Magic Attack, that's perfectly fine. Yep, because it's themed, and it, of course, it's freaking Yugi. Yep, Yugi gets all the good cards. So annoying. Like, Dark Evil, you have nothing. End your fucking turn. Good day, sir. You got wrecked by that unbanning of Thousand Iron Strip. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that I don't was... think I would have been able to handle that unless I had Thousand Iron Strip, so. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh my god, didn't you turn? Unless you want to quit. Okay, thank you. Just ended this turn. I thought it was just going to make him uh, lose. Okay, well, it's time for me to try and do something. Yeah. You have open field. I mean, I know I can't OTK him, but if you let me soul or reach soul charge, I can make Leo Dancer just. Just because, because why not? Go ahead. I don't care about the damage right now. Nah, I'm just I'm just gonna summon out Panther Dancer. I don't think they actually have a way to kill that thing. Uh, well, they can still target your place. Like I said, Leo Dancer, you at least uh can't be targeted or destroyed by card effect with its power. Wait, I just thought of something cool. No way, I I forgot I'm not running Drake or Sack. <laughs> 
I was going to say I could exceed summon these two. I could then detach your Dark Magician special summon it with Eternal Soul. And then uh, use the Wolf in my hand to summon Panther Dancer and be able to put him down to like a thousand life points. It's fine. Do whatever. This Black Wing guy went in with a, a Roshu. <laughs> He regretted it afterwards, I think. Uh, yeah, I think he regretted it. Yep. Okay, let's just attack and call the turn. Okay. I mean, if they do anything, I have the soul charge and and such in my hand, so it's not like I can't make Leo Dancer at a, at a drop of a pin. And so the other guy, he still has resources. I mean, he lost his vector pendulum, but he still has plays. I know that. No, he doesn't. I just set a Grand Horn of Heaven. Yeah. <laughs> what, you're not playing Solemn Strike because it's so broken and it's still at 3? Like, there's just no reason to play Grand Great Horn, I mean Grand Horn of Heaven when Strike is at 3. Yeah, I'm actually running Strike at 3 and 1 Grand Horn of Heaven. I just didn't draw a Strike is all. Oh, well, of course you're going to draw that Grand Horn and that Soul Charge. But I have Soul Charge in my hand. I know, but of course you're going to draw them because they're at 1. Did you really just set some more back row? Box? Yes, he Box, I'm about to blow you away again. Like, <laughs> you don't learn. You should not be Dark able to magic resolve. Attack. <laughs> you should not be able to resolve two of those in one duel Go on the same away. guy. Go away, you gay bird. <sighs> Sorry about my brother. Hey. So, uh, I think you should just finish him now because I don't think this guy knows what he's doing. I think so. I think that's a game. Do you have a Dark Magician in the deck still? Yep. My last Dark Magician. And that should be game. Tack, banish, tack, 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 game. Yeah, that's that's overkill. Mm -hmm. Now, what did he set? Oh. What on earth are we dueling? That's what I want to know. I don't know. It just seems like a deck full of normal monsters. No one monster dot deck. <laughs> well, uh, we won, so I guess on to game two. Yep. Okay, I'll host. All right, victory. <laughs> All right, bear back. Uh, be wondering why on earth you're teaming up with me when they see the deck I have. Also, did your deck want to go first or second? No, uh, it really doesn't matter. It's up to you. Because either well, my way, deck, my deck. Uh, really works best when they have a big hand or field. Okay, so go second. Okay. Because I have this one XC monster that can deal like two, two to four thousand burn damage if you have a lot of cards on the field. And plus, it, I have a rank up version of it, so that's always a thing. And sorry about having a uh, bad. Oh, by the way, before I forget, you gotta start the recording. Oh, it started. Oh god, are we playing Rainbow Neos Turbo? Yep. Yep. Oh god, I really hope that this build is bad like the last two people, otherwise we were about to get great. Yep. Send Shadow Mist, search for Neos, and then there, there's Rainbow Neos right there. Oh no, they're Polly. Okay. Is it time? Is it Rainbow Neos time? Yeah, wow, really it's not Rainbow that. Neos time. Really? And I... <laughs> I actually have an okay hand. Like, I can deal some burn damage and have an XC monster on the field. And then I can have Magic Cylinder plus uh, Blazing Mirror Force. I don't like Magical Cylinder. <laughs> Does anybody really like Magic Cylinder? No. Scrubs. <laughs> Noobs. <laughs> anyway, this is the deck. These are the two cards that make the archetype. Actually, they're the only cards that make the archetype. Okay. I said, as long as you got plays, I don't care. <laughs> Damn, oh, get Max C'd on. Get dunked on. I don't like Max C. Max C makes me a sad panda. So what are you gonna do? Are you actually gonna XC or are you just gonna leave those two? Might be best just to leave those two. No, well, I mean, I'm gonna go into Grillosaurus. I'm, I was gonna make a second XC play, but I'm not gonna now. You gave that man a pot of greed. <laughs> I still have a cold. 
I forgot that was even a car, Granosaurus. You haven't seen him since that freaking uh, Utopia s <laughs> starter deck. <laughs> I didn't even know he was in a starter deck. I honestly only run him because of the nature of a cha-cha. I mean, it's going to be very difficult for you to burn 16,000 life points, but whatever. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you're here for. I'm just here to deal mild inconvenience, and you're here to deal with the frets that keep me from dealing with minor inconvenience. Oh, boy. <laughs> okay. I have, I'm going to magic still under that. Sure. Or I could Fire Force. No, Magic now, Cylinder. Magic Cylinder. I want to say Fire Force when they have more threats on the field. Mm-hmm. Yeah, if only I... I kind of wish I used the Warrior Returning Alive now, but oh well. Uh, okay, I dealt about about 6,000 damage. It's all on you now. I hate you. Oh, God. And what kind of back row, too? Do you have a way to get rid of the back row? Not right now. Not right now. <laughs> okay, how badly are we about to get destroyed by back row? Uh, depends. Depends on what he stops. If he stops this, then that would be pretty bad. With like a solemn strike or something, that would be pretty bad, because I kind of, I would like to get my Magician's Rod effect. Okay, we are back again. Break the skill? No, I can hop out the way with that. Illusion. Nah, I'm gonna resolve my effect. Give me two dark conditions. Circle. Nice save, you Bell. Mm-hmm. I top decked him that. That would suck if he actually would have got that stop off. Well, do you have a way to get the dark magic attack going? Not right now. Not this turn. Next turn I will. Oh well, at the very least you have plays, and that's all that matters in the game of Yu-Gi-Oh. Well, that and actually not dying turn one to uh, full power Pepe. Ugh, uh, I mean, I'm probably going to shuffle my deck anyway, but okay. kind of sucks that I didn't get any Dark Magician S card, so... Not really doing Yeah, that'll happen circle. sometimes. Uh, one, two, three. I would say we should do Dark Magician plus the Dark Magician Girls as one of our tag duels, but my Magician Girl deck got completely screwed up by Deb Pro. Like, it's missing 16 cards. No, oh, mom's home. Delivery came. Hello, Please, my okay. son. Oh, I'm recording. Hi. I'm sorry. Hello. <laughs> also, I just nah, realized yeah, you, have eternal, you have eternal soul plus solemn warning. You can do things. Yeah, I can do things. Just, I'm a little slow, but that's just the Dark Magician deck for you. It's a little slow. <laughs> Well, it's still faster in my deck. So, I'm like, guessing like, it's time for that, uh... Well, if he polys, you can special summon one of the magicians from your hand. Then on the new chain, your, uh, magician circle will activate, allowing you to banish the Rainbow Neos. Before he does anything? Yeah. And if that doesn't work, you always have Solemn Warning. I can't Solemn Warning that. You can, you just have to solemn warning the, the poly, not the actual summon. Oh, yeah. The solemn warning the poly. It's like, I can't solemn warning freaking uh, Rainbow Neos hitting the field. Okay, well, I guess my monster's probably dead. Uh, I can block it with uh, Eternal Soul. Well, so if you do that, then I can attack directly, make another Xyz summon, but I don't know if I can game him next turn. I don't think so either. Side, what, what do you think? Side, do you think, I should, you think I should go for the push right now? I think you should, because then the Black Metal Dragon will have no targets, because this is the Rainbow Neo Sky. I can make another Xyz summon and deal, like, 5,000 damage. Okay. Yeah, I, I think I can actually game him, provided that none of those cards are a Mirror Force of some kind. Just like usual, I'm just kind of worried about all that fucking back row. Like, holy shit. <laughs> I never Not knew a Twin no Twister in sight. Do you even run Twin Twister in your deck? No. Ow, that sucks. I definitely needed that. I sort of... This build is really old, okay? I haven't updated it in months. Then why are you using it? Like, because most of my decks have been destroyed by Devil. God, I hate deliberately losing tag duels because my partner is not good. <laughs> Hey, right. I'm, I, it's not my fault that Dev Pro decided to do this. Oh my god. Well, that hurt. That really hurt. Of course, everybody gets fucking the warning.
God damn them, generator. God, I hate you so much. <laughs> Let's see what I can do here. Like, so much fucking back row. Like, oh, my God. I'm, I'm hoping that I can do stuff. You're not really doing anything. <laughs> <laughs> I've dealt more damage than you. Does that count for anything? No. <laughs> I hate burn decks. They do nothing but burn resources for life points. Not even worth it. Well, this is an old deck from the early Zexal era. I'm doing what I can. And let me guess, you don't have any good rank 3s either. Actually, I have the good rank 3s. I just don't have anything I think that's going to get over a 2400 body. So I think I'm just going to make a mech equip. What do you think? I mean, I could I would make like to a... go ahead and kill that freaking red wyvern and get rid of that black metal. Well, it's still equipped. Well, I can do that. Okay. A sec, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Don't tell me I didn't... Oh, whatever. Well, I'll unmanged. just... We're gonna go with Asset Golem. They're probably gonna destroy it anyway. It could have went... Oh, wait. Doesn't Asset Golem lock up a Saturn Special Summoning? Yeah, but I'm pretty sure that we're gonna lose the monster anyway. Look at all that back row, man. I'll be surprised if this attack goes through. Oh, it actually does. I guess he doesn't care about the Acid Golem because you can't special summon anymore, so. True, but Acid Golem is also bigger than most cards in their decks outside of Rainbow Neos. Oh, God. <laughs> Wait, why on earth would you activate that if you weren't gonna... Yeah, now you don't control the Red Eyes. Don't you think you should have maybe done that earlier? Whatever. Well, he doesn't have any Red Eyes in the graveyard, does he? No. Okay. Now... I'm actually kind of surprised. I was expecting something to happen. I was expecting something to happen, too. I'm kind of shocked. Well, even if... They'll probably destroy it on the Rainbow Neos <laughs> guy's turn, then. Like, wow. Like, I mean, I was expecting him to make some plays. I wasn't expecting him to just let that Acid Golem sit on the field. Okay. That's a Golem attack. That yeah, my bad then. I was expecting him to actually have. No, a it's fine. We're winning, so I I I can't say shit. We're winning. It's just I'm kind of worried about everything after this. Yep, like, as am I. It's about time for this Rainbow Neos guy to summon his Rainbow Neos. So, like, if you in see... before in before the plot twist where there is no Rainbow Neos. It's sort of looking like that. Like it's actually gonna be a plot twist. <laughs> <laughs> There's a plot twist like that. I'm gonna be like. Wait, hey, next turn it might be best just to go ahead and take the two thousand life points, and then all you have to do is just summon a monster with nine hundred attack and attack with acid golem and your nine hundred attack monster for game if he doesn't play any monsters. Yep. Although I don't think that's gonna have. Also, wait, what? What? You already searched room on. Okay. Okay. Um... Like that does nothing. There comes to the end result of this duel. I'm doing what I can here. Did you just walk in, say shh, and then leave the door open where all the cars are going by and it's hella loud? <laughs> Miracle Vision. He has a hero? And... You confuse me sometimes. Okay, I'm Also, I'm going to close he's... the door because I think people are coming in. I'm assuming he's going to go into... I don't, I don't know who you're going into. Which... That's right, right now. Uh, I think it's probably gonna be like a shining angel or something. Yeah, I'm thinking I mean, shining. Wanted to hear shining. No way, he doesn't have any light. Yeah, he does have lights. You can do that if he wants to. Yeah. So. Then he can actually run over Acid Golem. Wait, what would he be? 29, wouldn't he? There's only one banished. He'd be 32, I think. No, it's for every banished hero. Oh, it's Gaia. Oh. Didn't see that coming. I think I'll just go ahead and hit you with this just blazing mirror force. Just blaze mirror force. I think it's about I think it's about a good time as any go ahead and hit you with this mirror force, because fuck you. I'm back, he ran me over, didn't he? Nope. nope, he tried to. He tried to. They're probably thinking like, why on earth is there a burn deck in tags? I mean we're winning, so. We're winning, but I think that's just because they didn't expect any burn deck to be here. Does he actually have a response to that? Maybe. Nope, he doesn't. Yay, we're not dead yet. 
So all you have to do is summon a monster with 13, and you should be able to go for game. Actually, we get 3,000 now. Oh, yeah, we're back to 3,000. Right, that's game, then. Take the 2,000. Yeah, I'll just take the 2,000. Back, gonna without, run... back without us going for game, GG. GG. I am actually surprised. I honestly thought we were going to die because of the deck I ran. I just... We actually won. Yeah, I was. I thought we were going to lose, too. I was about to get a little bit salty. I was about to go a little bit mad at you for not bringing something at least remotely competitive, but we won, so... We won somehow. I I, I don't know how, but we did. The life points just melted. <laughs> well, I guess I guess this that's the moral of today's lesson. Never mock a deck until you, until you go into tag and it somehow becomes relevant. That's a long lesson. I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> well, that seems to be the lesson today. I, right. I, I don't know why, but it is. All right, well, we're done. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna update these decks so that next time I do anything, you actually have decks to play. Okay. So you yeah. know, in, be in before Deb Pro destroys more of my decks. So anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed. Thank you, Alexa, for joining me. No problem. Hope to see you all again soon. Yep. The uh, link to Alexa's channel will be in the description. So go ahead and go over to her channel and check out her content. So uh, thanks for watching. Thanks for the support. Uh, the I believe the deck suggestions should be up, and then the polls and all that should be ready to go. And uh, we should be changing up the decks on Daily Duels this upcoming week, so I look forward to it. So, uh, yeah. Thanks for watching, people.